Another fun feature to include in your roller coaster would be a time waster, sort of like a, a funnel. You could also make a half pipe, or you could do a, well, I don't know what it's called, but I'll show you what it looks like. So I'd probably find something bigger than this circle, but what you want to do is you cut out the circle. You can do a neater job than I'm doing. Once you have your circle cut out, you want to cut a straight line to the middle, about where the middle is, and then you want to put a hole that's slightly larger than the marble. And you want to make it larger than the marble because when I overlap these edges to make the funnel, that hole is going to shrink in size. Now depending on how much you overlap it, you could overlap it just a little bit and you have a very shallow funnel. You overlap it a lot and you get a steep sided funnel. So I like to do somewhere in the middle. But depending on the speed in which the marble is rolling into the funnel and the direction in which the, the marble is rolling into the funnel will determine how successful your funnel is. So I like to put a piece of tape on both sides. And then uh, an important characteristic of these funnels is that they have to be stable. If the, if the marble rolls in and then the, the funnel starts shaking back and forth, the marble is going to fall straight down the hole. So you want it to, I'm going to get it going, but you want it to be stable and very still, and you can see that the marble rolls around and around and eventually would fall through. So that's how to make a funnel. If the marble is coming in and you have it at a good angle, you have it at a, good, a pretty good speed, but it just keeps rolling off the side, then you could always figure out a way to put a guardrail around the outside and that just helps keep the marble in if it's moving too fast and usually sends it back in the way you want it to go.